the Scottish Youth Film Foundation is something that I think has that uh, possibility for, for, for kids to go, I can do that and I can actually tell my stories and they're relevant and I, I think I'm good and I think I'm good enough. To touch on your dad, obviously, you know, terrible, sad, tragic loss last year. How have you been since then? It's a very strange thing because, you know, to me, uh, my father was my dad and to many, many people, he was, you know, this big, you know, superstar and things. I know there's talk of a, a memorial and possibly scattering his ashes on a, a golf course here in, in Scotland. Is that, do you think that would be fitting? I think it would be very fitting. It's just, uh, I mean, you know, originally we we're talking about, you know, it's his birthday on the 25th of August and we were thinking about doing it, you know, this year, but it's, there's, I don't think there's any way, you know, there's, um, it's all still too much in the, up in the air. Would St Andrews be the, the most fitting? Is that his, was that his favourite, do you think? Yeah, I think, I mean, he used to go up there and play in various tournaments and uh, his friend Michael Medwin and he used to play in the Jubilee Vars and all these things and he had great memories. And I don't know how this happened, but for some reason I always remember St Andrews being sunny, which I'm... <laughs> I guarantee you it wasn't always sunny but for some reason it always seemed to be sunny um and we had uh you know we had fantastic times up there